So Sharon, we know that rough sleeping is a real issue uh, for Birmingham. So what's the impact of the PSPO on the work that we're doing to support rough sleepers? I think there's going to be a huge impact because I still go out as a cabinet member, I still go out and I do outreach. And one thing that stands out for me is the fact that we see so many rough sleepers who are being um, bullied and victimised and they are a community and as much as we need to try and get them back indoors into properties, we need to protect them while they're out. It's not acceptable for people to come in and speak to our rough sleepers and try to bully them or sell them drugs and I think it's those are the kind of people this order will help the police to be able to act on quickly because the safety of the community the homeless community is absolutely essential to us as much as it is the safety of everybody else. So this is really important to helping support the most vulnerable who are being targeted by those who are involved in criminal activity? Absolutely, it's definitely targeting those people and we need to support our rough sleepers as I say. There's a matter of times I've been told um, if someone's been robbed, their sleeping bag's been stolen, someone's targeting them with drugs selling it to them and that's what leads to the wider issues that we seeing and we also make sure there's a mechanism for absolutely stamping that out because that cannot take place in the streets of Birmingham.